Fresh from their midweek draw against Krasnodar in the Champions League, Julien Stefan's Rennes returned to league action, looking to return to winning ways after back-to-back -back draws. Still unbeaten in the league, the Brittany side welcome Angers to Roseanne Park. Stefan Moulin's team were also without a victory since September, and conceded 13 goals in their last four Ligue 1 Uber Eats matches. It was inside 20 minutes. Rennes were able to find themselves in front after a goalkeeping error allowed Adrian Unu to bounce. A horror moment for Paul Bernardoni to look back on. The big money signing for Angers. Not dealing with the ball across from Family Day. And Adrian Unu, 22 of his 23 goals have all come at Roseanne Park. And yet Angers didn't let their heads go down. Stefan Baoken. Powerful running. Later on a plate for Sufjan Buffel. The aid of a deflection. But a wonderful moment for the forward who left Angers as a 20-year-old. Four goals for the club in Ligue 2. This is very first in the top flight. Although Damien De Silva, the Ren captain, is expected to do a lot better with his body positioning. Leaving Alfred Gomez no chance. Julian Stefan looking for an explanation. Ren on course for a fourth match without a win. Bohokan then released again, this time one-on-one. -on -one. Gomez doing brilliantly, deny the forward. And Buffal took it for a run, although down a cul-de-sac. Well, Buffal, the priceless moment in a Scoe shirt. Ren unbeaten in seven at home against Scoe, spanning over 47 years. And yet a shock defeat was suddenly on the cards. Angelo Fugini was the man to keep his eye on the ball and very much the prize. Ren's defence falling apart around Gomis. Missed header. Damien De Silva seeming more interested in Fugini than the ball. Gomis trying to come to deal with the situation. And just dropped over his head. It could have been worse. Buffal. Thought he'd got his second. The stunning save from Gomis. At least kept the score to 2 1. But Angers celebrating at the final whistle, claiming a first win over Les Rouges Noirs since 1976, as Rennes' fine start to the season continues to unravel.